Frost esque is cool. Yo, literally a big part of this for me, like a really big part of this escalation, this patch, and the future dolls, or the, the short future dolls is going to be the cosmetics. Like, they look sick. Have you guys seen this stuff? So you've got, this is the escalation armor, except for the helmet. This is the Ursko weapon. Like, I'll just go through all the stuff I, I, that I've seen. So let's go through weapons real quick. So you got the axe. You got the sword. Got the hammer. That's not the hammer. Pause. The hammer. Looks like a hammer. Love to see it. The chain of the braids. Those look pretty cool too. The pike. Looks like a pike. What you'd expect. Repeaters, I don't know what to say about these. Like, they, they look cool. They look good like this. And then Strikers. Those are pretty sick. Those look sick. Got the little claw action going. Now, this helmet isn't from the Behemoth. You have, this is the Behemoth helmet, which I don't like the fur on it, bro. If the fur was gone, it's easily one of the best helmets in the entire game. But with the, with the fur, the boots and the fur, man, I, I ain't about it. Ain't about it too much. I, I don't Fs with it that heavy, you know what I'm saying? But this helmet's pretty cool. Do not translate, Poggers. And then you have a variation of this helmet, Rag Ragnar's Jehelm. Jehelm. That's a banger and a half, brother. Like, where's that thing at? Then you have Searing Dawn, which we assume is from Blaze vs. Kiri. That looks pretty cool, too. It's got like a weird color to it though that will mess up like certain mogs, but hey, it is what it is. And you have Wreath of the Shadows. Looking like a little toucan, toucan Satan out here. So that's freaking sick too. And those are the helms that I'm aware of. Now for body armor, you've got that chest piece and you have this. The pauldrons look nice. Like this, this set is what matches with the helmet. Like that's that's what the the set's for. And that's all I can see right here. Like if I, if I change the whole mog, it'd look like this. Look, looking like a a very bulky Power Ranger. And there's also mogs for. The sword, apparently. Like, you have this thing. The Exquisite Sunburn. That's a banger and a half, brother. I'm not sure what else had a mog. I'm pretty sure it was just this. But that sword mog is sick. I'm not sure what the heck it's for, but it's sick. Oh no, you had Thorns of Dusk, too. These are from Umbral Koshai, apparently. So... A lot of cool stuff, man. I'm actually really excited for these these transmogs. They seem dope. Is Umbral Koshai? That's what we assume. Like, we, we we don't know, but we assume that. Like, we assume this is from Umbral Koshai, and that the other helm, this is from Blaze of Kiri. We don't know. I assume this is... I don't know what I don't know what this is from. I'm not sure what the heck Ragnar's J-Helm is, but this this helm is sick. And the the other assumption is those will probably... Those will probably be rumors. That's the other thing. Because they're definitely going away from the old way of getting stuff, which was do drops. Like, you just, oh, randomly get a drop. That isn't what they want to have happen, so the assumption is we'll get those through rumors. They might also have a different method of getting uh, whatever those things are, those cosmetics.